KSIL. This is News 3 at 6. Good evening, I'm Mark Kiesling. And I'm Julie Williams. Illinois lawmakers will resume their spring session next week. Now, one of the key items up for vote is the green energy bill. But there's another bill being considered that would give felons the right to vote. News 3's Danny Valle joins us live in the studio with more. And Danny, one local lawmaker told you that bill is unconstitutional. Yeah, Mark and Julie, the Illinois Constitution states people convicted of felonies lose their right to vote until their sentence is complete. This proposed bill, however, would grant voting rights to current inmates in county or federal prisons. But Metropolis Representative Patrick Windhorst says the law is clear. He says those serving sentences should not have the right to vote. That is part of their punishment. But his biggest concern is allowing people convicted of serious crimes to have a right they don't deserve. Windhorst voted no on the bill during committee, saying it would require a change to the Illinois Constitution. If we allow those who are currently incarcerated serving a sentence in prison to vote, uh, to me, I, I don't believe that's appropriate. Most of the voters would agree that that's one of the things we should lose. And that bill is not just limited to jailed inmates. It also grants the right to vote for those serving probation, parole, or on programs like work release. It would also put the responsibility on correctional facilities to provide inmates access to mail ballots and voter registration. And it's still unclear whether that bill will be among the discussions next Wednesday following the Green Energy Bill on Tuesday. Maine and Vermont are the only states in the country that allow jailed felons to vote. Live in the studio, Danny Valle, News 3.